Can a trustee also be a beneficiary? Yes, a trustee can also be a beneficiary of a trust. It's fairly common for a trust beneficiary to also serve as trustee. For example, in a family trust created by two spouses, the surviving spouse will almost always serve as both a trustee and beneficiary. It's also common for one adult child to serve as a trustee of a trust after the parents pass, even if there are other kids. What's a trustee? A trustee is the person or entity responsible for managing and distributing trust assets. Trustees have a fiduciary duty to make responsible decisions and act in the best interests of the trust and its beneficiaries. Generally, a trustee must ensure that the trust assets are distributed as the trust creators intended. What is a beneficiary? A trust beneficiary is a person who is named in the trust and entitled to receive a part of the trust assets. Depending on the terms of the trust, a beneficiary may receive their inheritance at the time the creators pass, or the assets may remain in trust for a specific amount of time. Can a trustee take a salary from the trust? Yes, trustees are legally entitled to receive reasonable compensation for their services, unless the trust says otherwise. Generally, the creators of a trust will make clear in the trust document how a trustee should be compensated. Under the California Probate Code, a trustee is legally entitled to receive payment as detailed in the trust instrument. The trust document may provide for the trustee to receive a certain percentage of the value of the trust assets, an hourly rate for the work that they do, or simply a flat fee. However, when the trust document does not dictate how the trustee fee is going to be calculated, the California Probate Code goes ahead and fills in to say that a trustee is entitled to receive reasonable compensation in those circumstances. Can a trustee take assets from a trust? No. In most instances, trustees cannot take assets from a trust. This is often referred to as embezzlement, sometimes self-dealing, but more simply, it's nothing more than stealing. A trustee can only use trust assets to benefit the trust beneficiaries. Trustees must abide by the terms established by the trust creators and cannot take assets for their own personal use. Due to the fiduciary relationship trustees have with the beneficiaries, trustees have a legal obligation to act in the beneficiary's best interests. That fiduciary duty prevents a trustee from using trust assets to primarily benefit themselves or third parties who are not beneficiaries. Self-dealing occurs when a trustee uses trust assets to capture a benefit for themselves instead of the trust beneficiaries. This means that trustees cannot use trust assets in transactions that benefit themselves to the detriment of the beneficiaries. When it comes to managing a trust, a trustee must prioritize the beneficiary's interests above their own at all times. For example, unless the trust document permits it or a trustee obtains special approval, trustees cannot, one, sell trust assets to themselves, two, make loans or gifts to themselves, three, divert trust assets to benefit themselves. Four, sell trust assets to another trust or another entity that benefits them instead of the beneficiaries. When should I contact a trust litigation attorney? If you suspect a trustee is stealing from your trust, engaging in self-dealing, or you're not receiving the assets you're entitled to, you should contact a trust litigation attorney as soon as possible before the assets are gone and no longer collectible. An experienced trust litigation lawyer can evaluate your case and, if necessary, represent you in that litigation to pursue that dishonest trustee. Have questions? We protect people like you every day. Give us a call, shoot us an email anytime. The consultation is always free. Thanks for watching.